looking forward to this bohemian rocker trend for the upcoming season of spring summer 09 studded leather chain hobo fringe it's gonna be fantastic I'd have to say the whole motorcycle rocker chic look um, it's kind of upper east side meets lower east side puppy meets hipster girl uh, we're doing uh, a lot of stuff with like motorcycle inspired uh, styles so right now we have um, a bunch of things that like are just kind of motorcycly but modified into another style. For spring summer, I just love wearing sandals. I always have open toe sandals on, and I always have my anklet and toe ring on wherever I go. Embellishment. I think the embellishment trend is going to be really popular and exciting, and it's always something that people can change and improve on. So I'm really excited for hardware and jeweled things, stuff like that. Jeans with embellished. Back pockets. Um, I think studs are just a huge trend for 2009 fall. Um, I did a whole dress with um, the silver studs on the pockets and the belt, and I just think it's kind of feminine, but it has a little bit of edge to it. A lot more studs, a lot of distressing, a lot of rips, a lot of black and distressed black. Um, I would say one of my favorite trends would be like the detailing as far as like grommets and different jewelries and different things like that like I'm really looking forward to accessorizing especially with like handbags and different things that you can wear with a dress and just dress it up or dress it down my favorite trend for the upcoming season is lots of layered necklaces short ones medium ones and long ones all worn at the same time I'm looking forward to pearls I think pearls are big and they're actually fun in these colors we have bangles and other items that have pearls, and I think that's going to be a fun trend. You're going to see it on a lot of different accessories. I'm also looking forward to just having lots of bracelets. Um, I like that whole stacked bracelet thing mixed all together. Well, I created the stackable bangle for Layla Jewelry because I think it's going to be the next hot trend. I'm really excited about dresses. I think that um, they've kind of... They were really hot, and then now everybody's schlepping around in t-shirts and jeans, and I think the dress should come back and be strong and girly and feminine. Um, that would have to be the maxi dress. And also the slouchy tank. The one-piece romper, because you can wear it with little gladiator sandals or flats or even a little heel. I'm looking forward to things getting back to being a little bit grubby and dirty. Uh, it's been very sweet and girly for a long time, which is super cute and cool, and I love that too, but it's time to go back to something a little bit more, you know, raw. Trends, I would have to say, is like my vintage tees. I'm definitely a denim girl, and so um, A-Stars, it has great vintage t-shirts, and I think that that's what I'm looking most forward to. More of the elegant bohemian look, kind of mixing and matching vintage with new, and having it be ethereal, but at the same time put together and layered. I love the trend of experimenting with washes, and I love vintage washed and ripped up styles. And so we've done a lot of that for both this summer and also fall. And I think you're gonna be seeing more and more of that on the street. And it just, I like it because it adds variety. I think slightly looser cuts on the trousers and the jeans, be more flowy. I've been rocking the skinny jeans for a really long time, but now I'm seeing people with all the sort of like, I want to say almost like MC Hammer looking pants or the genie ones that get like tight at the bottom but are baggier at the top, and I'm excited to find a pair of those. The trend that I'm looking forward to the most is beautiful, lightweight spring and summer denims that we're finding, made from beautiful uh, Pima cottons primarily out of Japan right now, but there's light on your skin and it makes wearing denim in the summertime a, a good thing to do. In the upcoming season, the best trend that I think will do well and that we're looking forward to is the boyfriend jean. You can see on Kenzel, uh, she has our abrasion uh, boyfriend jean on. It's uh, also a great staple for the closet. I like all the, um, the disco influences and sort of like the 80s influences, the, the ripped jeans, like Karen Elliott jeans, and then I'm insane for long dresses right now, like the tie-dye long dress, like the dress I'm wearing right now, and then our tie-dye yellow becomes in pink too, it's hot. My favorite trend coming up would have to be double layering. Um, we have these pieces in TT where they all come together double layered and I just think it's so fun and easy and comfortable most importantly. Probably the uh, oversized tees, you know, they're kind of like slouchy a little bit. I mean, 
something like this. Again, bright colors with uh, with prints and something something fun, easy to wear. I'm in love with hand dyed flowing fabrics for next season. Really light, fun for spring, really comfortable. We're doing a lot of mixing of fabrications, a lot of stretch satins with chiffon. Well, to follow up with him, I would definitely say plaid is the, the hottest trend coming up in upcoming season. Everyone's doing it. It goes great with denim. It goes great with khaki. You know, it's something that's. You know, it could be fashion forward, you know, with a lot of patchwork if you want. So I definitely think plan. I think that my favorite trend for the upcoming season is definitely the eco-friendly products that are coming out. I mean, we're all trying to take better care of our environment, and Maggie Bags does that by using recycled seatbelt webbing to make a great line of handbags. Ladies. Okay, Lots girl. of ladies. <laughs> Girls wearing tight pants. <laughs>